and in Isakrum, also in the Setra, Franklin's district, inadequate school infrastructure is hampering effective teaching and learning in the community's basic school. This is the basic school at Isakrum in the Setre Afram Plains district of the Ashanti region. Kindergarten pupils and junior high school students are housed in buildings, but classes 1 to 6 have no infrastructure, so they learn under this makeshift structure constructed by members of the community. Some pupils sit on benches to learn. We were told classes are disrupted any time it rains. The toilet facility in the school is not in use, compelling teachers and pupils to resort to the bush to attend to nature's call. The teachers do not live in the community because there are no quarters to accommodate them. Most of them live in Robonso, which is about 45 minutes drive away. Vehicles hardly ply the stretch because the roads leading to the community are not in a good state. Parents and community members say several attempts to construct a new block for the school on their own accord has proved futile. Pupils were crammed together to learn, so we decided to construct a new building, but we couldn't continue. The pupils are many. They need a new structure to accommodate them. They want the district assembly to step in to construct a new school block and a teacher's quarters. I know there are some NGOs out there who also look at helping our young brothers to have a very humane environment to study. So if they can also come in and help us, because there are still few that we have to clear, and so they can come in and support us as well. Our target is we should be able to have reduced that to probably on a quick count, less than say five schools, that will still be under these uh, uh, shady structures. That's it for Mission. Mission is supported by the Star Ghana Foundation with thanks to Danida, UK Aid and the EU. Thanks so much for watching.